What's up guys, this is Burt Music and welcome to the world's smallest shotgun in Modern Warfare. <laughs> What is this thing? <laughs> yeah, this is the new mini shotgun in Modern Warfare. You know, with the release of Warzone and Battle Royale, it's kind of completely overshadowed multiplayer, but just look at this little thing, man. It looks like a little mini brecci. How am I not gonna cover this? This thing looks hilarious. It's literally the brecci's little cousin failure. So here's some more information on this new mini shotgun. It's called the VLK Rogue, an agile 12 gauge mag fed shotgun from VLK with extensive options to modify range, stability, and maneuverability. Now, if you wanna unlock this thing for free, you have to use a shotgun with five attachments and get seven kills in 15 different matches. As you guys know, I've pretty much been going the free-to-play route with Modern Warfare recently because, you know, nothing's really been too crazy, nothing's been that good, but if you do go to the store in Modern Warfare, they have, like, this Hang 10 bundle, and they have the new shotgun in here. So, yeah, if you buy this for 1,200 COD points, you'll get the shotgun instantly. Full disclosure, I'm gonna go ahead and buy this today, I'm gonna have to get some COD points, so that way I can unlock it and show it to you guys. So that way, if this thing turns out to be horrible, you don't have to waste COD points, and you don't have to waste time trying to get it. So, yeah, let's go ahead and buy this bundle. Alright, I got the points, we should be able to buy the bundle now. There you go. Okay, I got some other pointless stuff too, but <laughs> really just getting it for the shotgun. All right, so let's see the new shotgun. We have the VLK Rogue. All right, there it is. We have the pipeline variant of the shotgun. Can I change any of the attachments on it? I kind of hope that I can. I'm not too sure, but I'm definitely going to try this thing in a private match first to see how it is. Oh, dude, Atrium will play on that tiny little map. All right, let's see what we can do attachment wise for this new shotgun. Muzzles. Oh my god, there's so many. This Forge Tack Marauder is going to increase the range the most, so I think I'll rock that. Oh my. What do we have here? The 16 inch Warlord. Oh my. This thing looks so stupid. <laughs> Can we get a sniper scope? I don't think you can get a sniper scope for this. That'd be pretty great though. Different stock options. You can take the stock off. This looks like something out of Battlefront. It's crazy. And then the ammunition. Oh my god, you can have 12 rounds. You can only have four rounds, but it increases the mobility and speed ups the reload. Oh my god. What are these ammo options? You could have 12 rounds, you could do eight round slug, or you can actually reduce the ammo you have to speed up your ADS, your movement, and your reload. This is so, so weird. weird. I'm gonna have to go with 12 rounds. I think this is gonna be the feed machine variant of it. All right, here we go. Ready to test this out on some bots. Gonna have a mozzarella pizza. I hate what I just said. What the f- what is this? This is a little mini brecci, dude. <laughs> oh my god, this looks so dumb. But at the same time, I love the shotgun. This is great. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god, it's pretty strong. Oh. Wait, is it a- is it a pump? Oh, I thought it was semi-auto. Okay. Well, I'm definitely wrong on that. Got a quad feed already, though. Right, split. Must get more. Come on, brecci. Dude, this thing is pretty gnarly. I like this thing so far. It's pretty good. <laughs> It seems like it actually gets some pretty consistent hit markers. Maybe it's not that strong, but I mean, that's pretty pitiful for that range. I have this thing geared pretty well too. I mean, maybe I could try out some different attachments. See how it does with the slug rounds. Oh shit. Okay. Well, you definitely have to be right on if you're gonna use slugs. Okay. Some kind of disappointing slugs. Whoa, never mind. Okay, the slugs will definitely help out with the range issue. But of course you have to be way more precise with slugs, so. Cut it off. Some hooligans. Ugh. The bots are bullying me. I can't even show you guys how good the shotgun is. I'm leaving. I'm out of here. <laughs> first impressions of the VLK Rogue shotgun, you know, it's okay. Even though this is just my first impressions of the shotgun, I don't think it has the potential to dethrone like the 725 or the Brecci. Come to think of it, maybe any of the shotguns that already exist in the game for free, which is probably a good thing. All four of these shotguns right here are pretty solid. They're pretty good in their own way. And I feel like this new mini shotgun is really supposed to be just like a fun shotgun. It might not be the best shotgun, but you know, it'll be fun to use. I'm going to try to find some regular shipment and I'm going to try it out in hardcore as well. Actually, no, I'm going to do hardcore first because because I don't have any attachments, so I'm gonna need all the help I can get. All right, we got some TDM on shipment. I just kind of noticed that I don't have the ability to change the attachments for this variant. I'm kind of worried now. What kind of attachments are on this thing? I don't even know. Okay, well, I'm getting attachments unlocked, so that's good. The shotgun just feels awkward for some reason. I don't know what it is. Oh. What the fuck is this lobby, dude? I'm in such a sweaty lobby. If these guys don't calm the fuck down, they're gonna start a grease fire. Oh my god, why are they all corner camping? <laughs> I want to show off the shotgun, but man, this is the most putrid lobby I've seen. Dead. Dead. Oh my fucking god. Dead. <laughs> oh look, he's laying on the ground. Q! Sick place to hell, bro. Are you fucking kidding me? You know you're gonna get executed. These guys are fucking gross. I- This was such a disgusting lobby. No wonder the best player on their team's name is Garbage King. <laughs> I still managed to be best on the team. I went 21 to 21. I don't think it really says too much about the shotgun because that lobby was horrible, but the good news is that as long as I use this variant of the VLK Rogue, I will eventually unlock it. Like right now, I can't customize the variant of the shotgun that I have, but if I keep using it, I'll eventually just get the base shotgun and then I can customize it more. Now we're doing some hardcore Dom on shipment. I mean, I'm worried. That last lobby was a nightmare. I don't know how many shots I actually have with this thing. 
Oh, and he's just laying down on B. Oh, okay. Come on, Eric. Gross. Oh, there's a dude. Why is there another guy laying down with a brecci in this lobby? Why am I cursed with people like this? His name is Kung Fu Kenny. Kung Fu Kenny was fucking camping. Brecci, 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 brecci. Oh my god, he's still doing it! Dude! Ah! What is this shit? God, I'm gonna lose it. This shotgun's just not as good as the other shotguns, man. Like, if you try to bust this out on shipment against the 725 or the Brecci, no. It's just gonna be a massive rip. It's definitely a challenge to use, though. I mean, I'm up for the challenge. I'm gonna try to hit a feed. I definitely have to get more attachments unlocked before that's probably gonna be possible, but that or just not get a shit lobby. Hey, for fuck's sake, lad. Why are you leaning there? Bro. Oh, shit! No, dude! I got the triple feed. That's a start. It is so upsetting leveling up the shotgun so much, but you can't even put any of the attachments on it. Come on, how is that not a collab, man? I feel like this thing's double kill potential is basically non-existent. Along with its regular killing potential. <laughs> Kung Fu Kenny, man. I'm already upset by your name, but the way you play, man. Oh. Oh my god, I have to reload, I have to reload. He's just camping. Oh, come on. Come on. What the? F I don't know. Everything feels like it's going in fast motion with this shotgun. I don't know how to describe it. This gun trips me the fuck out. I don't like it. Oh, come on. He's behind the barricade. Wait, does this thing have the four-round attachment? I'm not exactly sure, but man, it runs out of ammo way too fast. I gotta check out what kind of attachments this thing has, because it does not seem that good. I'm kind of regretting buying the shotgun early because the variant doesn't have the best attachments. And since it doesn't immediately unlock the base variant, you can't really get better attachments for it that quick, so... I don't know. I might have to revisit this thing when I can actually put good attachments on it. Because right now, it's one of those things where it's not bad, but it could definitely be better. Oh, I did not mean to pull that up, but that looked ugly. And that's a dead guy. Reload it, reload it. Come on. Nope. Man, there were like three or four people there. I could have potentially had something, but I don't know. Maybe this thing will do better in core. I got team killed. Great. Whoa, that hit. Holy shit. That's some good range. RPG by a teammate. Nice dude. I'm too salty to care. I'm team killing now. I get team killed like 10 times on average in a hardcore match, so. Come on. Perfect. Ah, okay. The last shot was a bum shot. Okay, well, it's over. I'm still not sure how to feel about this shotgun, man. I'm not even getting play of the game. I'm not even getting, like, that big of multis and stuff. Still best on the team, though. Drop 70-plus kills with it. I definitely feel like this shotgun has more potential, but I'm definitely not seeing it quite yet. In two games, I have this thing to weapon level 35. Now, that is partially because there's some double weapon XP going on, and I use a token, but I got this thing leveled up fast. You get the 6-inch revolt barrel, you get the 5 modern warfare laser. No stock, the four rounds attachment. Okay, that's why. Okay, that totally makes sense as to why this thing is so rage inducing now. You only get four shots and then you have to reload, which makes this thing pretty pitiful. Yep, I'm definitely still gonna have to do this challenge so that way I can actually have a better version of the shotgun. I'm upset now. So with that being said, let's try this thing out in core. I need to be like Kung Fu Kenny. Gaming with a brecci on shipment. Gotta camp for kill streaks. Camp, 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 camp. I think Kung Fu Kenny fucking triggered me off the face of this planet. It's over. I'm ruined. I can't enjoy this game now. Dude, how am I gonna beat anyone? I really don't think the shotgun is that bad, but man, you definitely need to put the right attachments on it. Oh lord. Wait, am I about to hit a feed in here? No, no I'm not. Who knows, maybe I could have some better luck playing core. Hey buddy. Okay, wait, hold on. Split feed coming in, split feed coming in. I'm gonna do it. Come on. Don't you fucking know! What? There was another guy there? I, I can't believe I'm failing some of these feeds. I don't know if I got that close to hitting anything just now, but... Why would you camp there? Quiet potato with an I'm bad clan tag? Kill me. Look like a mashed potato now! <laughs> Don't mind me just crossing the street. Okay. Yep, this is totally usable. I really don't want to rage quit because I don't want to, like, break my challenge progress, but... Wow, we got a kill, guys. Hey, it's been a fucking year. Oh my- <laughs> No! Something finally good could have happened! And then I'm just a little too far away. Fuck. Come on, let's keep it going. Gotta try to find more people somehow. Okay, no, this is over. 
Wait, maybe not. Oh, okay, it's definitely over. I'm starting to wonder if people already know how bad this shotgun is because I haven't seen anyone try to like kill me and then use the shotgun. I feel like they already know how bad it is. It hasn't always been the case with DLC guns in Call of Duty. Like sometimes people would exclusively just try to pick up your gun. They'd be camping, waiting for you, trying to hunt you down. And then this shotgun comes out and everyone's just like, no. Really feel like it. I actually got play with this. Wait, how did I get play? Is it literally? It's just my triple kill. And then it just cuts off there because it doesn't want to show my failure afterwards. That was quite possibly the saddest lobby I've played in a while. I want more hardcore on shipment, man. All right, here we go. This is for everything. Okay, I'm fucked. <laughs> I'm actually feeling a lot better about this lobby. It doesn't seem that douchey yet. Maybe it is. I don't know. I'm hit marking toes. I only get four shots with this thing, so I had to be like perfect. Oh shit! No! Split quad feet, come on! Aw man! If I didn't have that reload, I could have probably kept getting more. Okay, not bad. Getting some slightly better streaks going. I mean, you don't have that much ammo with the base variant, so... Really, the only kind of strategy is try to pull a quick quad feed and then die and start over. But if you can get the 12 round mag, you know, then you could definitely get a pretty big streak going. Oh my god, dude. If you could get consistent double kills with this thing, you know, it'd be so much better. Shit, dude. Oh, it's like a couple kills. Oh, we won! <laughs> dude, 100 to 99. That was so close. How did I do? I got 39 kills. Okay. Yeah, this lobby was definitely a lot better. I still the best on the team, but I was actually able to hit a split feed. And this new mini shotgun definitely has some potential. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the new mini shotgun in Modern Warfare. But once again, guys, code Merc is 30% off of G Fuel. The tournament is still going on, but this is the last day of round three. At least I think it's round three. It's like the top 16 right now. But regardless, I just wanted to thank all of you guys for using code Merc and getting us this far into the G Fuel competition. It really does mean a lot, and hopefully we can win this tournament. And with that being said, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did and you want some more new free guns in Modern Warfare, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later. Yeah.